Rob, I believe you've got a really interesting cable in your pocket there. Can you tell us about it? It's just an ordinary iPhone charging cable. Would you like to charge your phone on your computer using it? Not if you give it to me, because <laughs> I don't trust you. <laughs> so this is a, uh, it's called an OMG cable. As you can see, it looks basically indistinguishable from an, uh, an ordinary uh, USB-C charging cable. But it's basically like a rubber ducky on steroids. So it can do everything a rubber ducky can do, but it also has a Wi-Fi adapter built into it. So yep. the cable itself is broadcasting a Wi-Fi signal. It also has a little web server running on it as well, which is pretty, uh, pretty amazing. But what that means is you can connect to an OMG cable from literally outside in the street. So what it means is with a rubber ducky, you need somebody to take immediate action. You need them to connect the rubber ducky and then stuff to happen. With an OMG cable, it could be sitting there for days or weeks or months. I mean, if you leave cables out in a reception area in people an organization, will people will pick them up. I mean, they, maybe people are educated about USBs and they're not going to try and plug a random USB in. Are they educated about cables? Yep. I suspect probably not. I mean, there was an interesting story I read uh, or heard about a employee in Tesla quite a few years ago was offered a half a million dollars to plug a rubber ducky into a machine in Tesla. My argument with a lot of organizations is how much would it cost me to get for example, a cleaner to plug some of these in. Yep. I mean, you just say to them, look, there's some really dirty looking USB cables around the place. Would you mind just replacing them with these shiny new ones? They'd probably do it for yep, nothing. Exactly. You know, or maybe 20 bucks or 50 bucks. So it's it's not that difficult. But as I said, the fact that they are sitting there broadcasting a wireless network that you can connect to from outside in the street is what is so scary about those devices. And then you can send a commands to pull data out of the computer Anything and send it to the cloud or something, As right? I said, it's basically like a rubber ducky. So you can send commands, you can exfiltrate data with PowerShell, you can download and execute malware, you can open up a reverse shell. I mean, you've got effectively full control of the machine.